The two third force we get for the last election, the Labour Party and the NFPP, uh, the New Nigeria Post Party. It can't be like say there are two now. Can't they do anyhow? I don't even understand. These now the people where Nigerians believe say eh, they go wrestle power from the APC and the PDP in the last election. Election is over now. They don't define themselves. Labour Party is having its own fair share, a uh, fair share of in trouble. <laughs> One part break away, say eh. eh. Peter Obi, you go leave the court. We are not in support. Uh, so they don't expel, I be suspend the uh, uh, the national chairman Aburi. You know the uh, That's a problem now. What the Labour Party they face. Now you don't transfer now. Enter NMPP, the New Nigerian People's Party. Where they say now Rabi Okwankwaso be the presidential candidate in the last election. You know the The matter is plenty. For this NMPP, I be NM, uh, NMPP. Did they claim say Rabio Bankwaso who be their uh, uh, presidential candidate in the last election? Say him, get they involved with anti party. Say in the case of kind meetings, where they no agree to. You understand? Uh -huh. Say the party gets national working committee. You understand? And still get a, a, a board of trustees. On the end. Say that their party be the only party where get national working committee and board of trustees. And board of trustees can. You know, expel anybody or suspend anybody. Now that board of trustees now, according to them, now he suspend Rabio Kwakwaso will be the presidential candidate in the last election. When I say this matter, you get a CD. Eh? We could go on this small break. We will come back. I will not on a this waiting no good. Well, let's go on this break. centuries, the Ijele has been a revered masquerade in Igboland, a predominant tribe in southern Nigeria. The Ijele is a grand spectacle that commands respect, awe and celebration. Today, Innocent Vehicles brings you the Ijele in a new form, a majestic, robust and monolithic pickup truck designed to leave an indelible mark in the annals of automotive history. <laughs> The Innocent Ijele is equipped with a powerful 3.0L turbo engine and 4WD to conquer any terrain with ease. Make way for the Innocent Ijele, Innocent Vehicle, the pride of African roads. Well, welcome back. I beg, I don't want to talk too much. Let's build the foundation to this problem. That part now we say, eh, they don't suspend Rabi Wampaso. They are people. They get plenty things to talk. Uh -huh. Maybe we'll start from there. Then Abokado will now come back. You understand? We will now have two different people discussing this matter. Eh, one part will be say, eh, and then suspend Rabi Wampaso. And the other part will be, you know, you understand? Support Rabi Wampaso. But before we hear from these two parts, maybe we'll get the foundation of the problem. People will expel and be suspend that become so let us hear from them directly. We will watch this video. We we have uh, a constitution that puts that puts in the hands of the BOT of our great party what you will not find, the powers that you won't find in the constitution of any other party. And that is the powers to you know get things straightened out when the party gets into when the party gets into a difficult situation like we have now. The party noticed that since after the elections, there had been a lot of people engaging in different active party activities, most especially the, the presidential candidate of the party, uh, uh, Ravi Musa, Ravi Musa His activities has been purportedly illegal to the act of the party. So he had been having some other dealings with other parties, with the, the current uh, leadership in, in the country, with other political parties, without the concept of the party. And also paraded himself as the leader, as the national leader of the party. So the party went into the constitution to search, is there an office of a national leader? There's nothing like a national leader for a failed presidential candidate. And that is why we have said, he desists from saying he's a presidential, he's a national leader of the party, rather... And also, the party, the General Congress, the General Congress today has ratified that for investigation to properly take place, uh, Rabiu, Dr. Rabiu Mustafa Nkoso should proceed on a six-month suspension. The resolution of the BOT is what I have to anchor on. And uh, today we have come here and it was ratified. 
because uh, an adoption was done on it. So uh, I think we can go from there. Once it has been adopted, I think there's no going back on it. That is the stand of the BOT and the uh, national body here today. Oh, no, don't hear. Okay. The problem now is say, hey, how do you come pursue the again meetings with other presidential candidates? Say why? Without the consent of the party. He himself can't declare the air that he be the leader of the party after he don't lose the election, according to them. Say he is not the leader of the party. After all, he lost the election. Now the problem, now the antipathy, he gets meeting with other presidential candidates. Tinubu, Atiku, uh, Peter Obi. And say him the claim the form. Say eh, he is the leader of the party. When I don't hear, now the problem is that. Mwah, I will bring two people for Onana. We will digest this matter well, well, so that we will feel understand them. In total. One person I will carry on for owner. Now, Buba Galadima, a chieftain of the party. Then I will carry on. Enter the man now where they claim say eh, and he be the acting chairman of the party. They say in them now Abba Major. Eh, you hear me? So these two people now we will hear from them. No what's up. No first hear from Buba Galadima, a chieftain of the party. Watch this video. Let me right. put the record straight. Right. About a month ago, this disciplinary committee submitted its findings to the National Working Committee of the party. And the National Working Committee adopted wholesale the report of the disciplinary committee set up by it. And we applied to INEC three weeks' notice to hold a NEC meeting, National Executive Committee meeting mm -hmm. of the party. And today's meeting was attended by four representatives of INEC, mm -hmm. all the elected people on the platform of this party in the National Assembly and in the state assemblies, including our only governor, all the 37 state chairmen of the party were present, all the members of NEC were all present. The only person that was absent was Senator Rabi Musa Konkoso himself, who was represented by the vice presidential candidate of the party. Therefore, mm -hmm. if there is any meeting today, the authentic meeting is the one that was held in Abuja and attended by INEP. Three times they tried to smuggle a letter purportedly as elected representatives of this party to INEP and it was rejected by INEP. Now, what they did is a preemptive move because only seven of them were in that meeting of the chairman out of the chairman 10 that were sacked and their executives were, were, were dissolved. The issue is why did we dissolve those executive committees? Exactly. Why? Because they performed anti party activities, they were working for other interests outside NNPP during the election, they took money from us. They did not dispense. They also, they also, they also took our even uh, uh, agents' cards and sold to opposition parties in their states. We can't have such people in our party. We are not in the. We are not political jobbers. We are in this we, pa political uh, party is a serious business. Mm. <laughs> These people, where they make noise, say they don't know them all. They are not members of, in fact, they are suspended members of the party. Say these people, say they suspend them. Why? Because they, uh, they card the uh, party card where they give them. Say when they give agents, on the end, agents to who will carry out the, uh, like, uh, who, who, will, uh, who will represent the party during the last election. Say they carry that card, go they give members of the opposition party to stand in as agents of the party. So he's he even now they indirectly tell us that the reason why they lose that election. Now be that. Or are they this abuse? But what I'm talking about, this is what they make noise. Now they may be suspended people from the party. Uh, the people now will carry that their card, go they sell, they give opposition members, uh, this is party members to stand as their uh, party uh, this is agents. We'll make them lose the election. They're not suspended. So they are now coming back now, you understand, in full force to attack the party. Now they form this fractional side of the party. Who not get this end? Who back like my also telling us they don't get their own meeting and everybody will win the election on the platform of NMPP. 
we are in that meeting, including four representatives from where I neck to tell them and say, and at their own part, be the authentic side of the MNPP, the new Nigeria's People's Party. Say these people, now only seven of them carry out the matter. Seven of them. People they expect, they expect, they say they date them, but now only seven come back. I hear this thing now, they wrote this matter on top of their head. They their head. But make you hear from the side, uh, yeah, the acting chairman now of the faction where they claim say eh, that they suspend Rabbi Papasso from the party for playing anti party. Let's hear from Abo Major. The issue of anti party, yes, he has said it himself. But the good thing is that uh, the scripts are there. You know, the newspaper extracts, the TV scripts, they are all there. Everybody knows that they are the ones that are most guilty of these so-called anti-party activities they are talking about. I can challenge you to ask Buba Galadima, what exactly does he know as anti-party? He is known for that, from APC to new APC to PDP. Rabiu Musa Kwankwaso, everybody has it on records, on the TVs, the screens of the TVs, on the newspapers. He had series of meetings. On our way to the 2023 general election, he had series of meetings with presidential candidates of other political parties, a party that is clean enough and that runs on constitutional order. The presidential candidate of such a party has no right in any way at all, nowhere. In, the, in any part of our constitution, you know, to go into any form of discussion. Whatever is the, you know, uh, the, the crux of the discussion, the party should have known. The party decides on whether the attempts to have any discussion with PDP candidate or APC candidate or PRP candidate or Labour Party candidate is the party that decides whether such discussions are worth going into. But what we saw were situations where on his own, he would just stand up, either he's in France, or he's in Lagos, or he's in uh, Abuja, or he's somewhere, you know, either having discussions with one presidential candidate or the other. I don't know what uh, other thing qualifies somebody to be guilty of anti-party activities more than that. The truth is that Rabiu Musa Kwankwaso, senator, with respect, has flouted, flouted with all emphasis, all provisions of our constitution that has to do with the sacredness of loyalty to our party's constitution. The truth is that he came in as a candidate. Yes, at a certain moment he was the leader of the party. There's no doubt about that. But being leader of the party and being the presidential candidate never gave him the license to go into things that were capable of dragging and of course dragged the name of the party into disrepute. These were the concerns of the BOT. When I don't hear from Abu Major. Abu Major talks say, look, eh, now we now, now we form the party. Eh, now we get the party. The party has been in existence for 21 years. Say, how about not one person go to get meet with us informing them, with other presidential candidates? Say, wait till they solve. Say, whether well, one person will hijack the party. <laughs> we we'll get this study. Say, how you go get meet? You suppose tell us, say, eh, you understand? We won't get meetings and we'll give our consent. But you went ahead and had meetings in Paris, in, 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 in Lagos, in Abuja, without telling us how we're not going to expel you from the party. Say that one, anti party. <laughs> he choke, have you no choke? He choke. But this side now, when they make this noise, how many did they? How many? How many are you guys? Did uh, your own party now, your own side now, when we want to do on our meeting, did any representative from INEP come? Anybody? Did any elected member of our party come on a meeting? Anybody, whether in a state house of assembly or national assembly or even the only governor won again, they come on a meeting, they don't come. So, which legitimacy now on a get now to suspend Rabbi Kwankwa? So, we be on a presidential candidate in the last election. On a not see the confusion. <laughs> the only thought for so we managed to get for this election, for this country now. We, be like, say, they won't take power from the APC and the PDP. They won't put them on their toes. Now, they'll be the, 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 I want to put them now. They search lights with them on top. These old parties, APC and PDP, to make sure say they do the right thing. Now, them can't they do like this. I don't know. Whether they sit there somewhere, they, they fuel all these things to make sure say they scatter all these parties. We don't raise their head to, 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 to wrestle with the giants in the political corridor. Or, or not they get the gist. So, I don't just understand. But 
Last, last, we will be there for here. Nothing is sitting under the sun. We will all get to the roots of this matter. Now, where I go end up, I go see on that later.